We begin with breaking news tonight in a major break in the search for this woman, Raquel Calderon, missing and presumed murdered at the hands of her estranged husband. And tonight, detectives may have solved this cold case, discovering the victim's car in a canal with human remains inside. Local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournay live now in West Miami Day to pick up the story from here. Terrell. Well, Calvin and Lori, the missing woman's SUV was found late today and pulled from a canal. And detectives here at Miami Dade PD confirm that human remains were found inside. You may remember the story. September 2012, Raquel Calderon disappeared after she left work one night. Earlier in the day, her estranged husband showed up to her job and the two argued, but he left. She was reported missing later that night, and that's when police learned that she had filed for divorce after being with her husband for 20 years. Now, about five months later, Jesus Maquieta, the estranged husband, was in court. All of this after he was questioned by detectives. His statements and alleged admissions eventually led to his arrest. Maquieta was charged with first-degree murder and stalking, even though police had no body. The 54-year-old allegedly made light of the lack of physical evidence in this case. That is, until today, when human remains and the missing woman's SUV was pulled from a West Miami-Dade canal on Chrome Avenue, about a mile north of Southwest 8th Street, a very desolate area. But this new development could help strengthen this ongoing murder case. He did tell detectives the fact that, um, you know, you don't, if, if you don't have a body, you have nothing on me. They weren't going to give up until they found a body. This family deserves closure. And sure enough, 16 months later, they leads in, the investigation leads into a canal. And the remains and that SUV are now in the possession of the medical examiner's office. They will now move to try and make a positive ID to see if those remains belong to that missing woman. The missing woman's family has already been notified. They are on edge just waiting for those results to come through. You have to remember this was a mother of three and nearly two years in the making for this case. That husband remains locked up tonight in the Miami-Dade County Jail. That is the latest here from Miami-Dade PD headquarters. I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.